In the ever-expanding world of genetic testing, health experts are now finding an abnormal gene mutation that increases the risk of breast and other cancers more than previously thought. And that is the focus of our HealthCast today. Bertha Brooks began her battle with breast cancer 26 years ago when she was only 40 years old. They had done three different biopsies on me and when they did the biopsies, all of the biopsies came back negative. And I said to my doctor, I said, that's not right. I said, something's wrong. Bertha underwent a mastectomy to remove the affected breast. Then in 2018, she developed cancer again in her other breast. Genetic testing revealed a mutation in a gene called PALB2. We're learning more about the gene. Women who test positive for this genetic mutation, they have an elevated risk for breast cancer. It ranges anywhere from 41% to 60% um, by the age of 70. Oh, it's good to see you, how are you? Breast surgeon Dr. Margaret Thompson with the Cleveland Clinic Weston says the gene mutation can be passed on to both women and men. They would both be at risk for breast cancer and pancreatic cancer. Men would be at risk for prostate cancer, and women are also at risk for ovarian cancer. People with the genetic mutation need to undergo much more frequent screenings and close surveillance. I know that I have to stay on top of my family members and go, it's not just me, you need to get the genetic testing too to make sure you're okay. Now there is some good news because once it is identified, there are medications that can help target that PALB2 gene mutation.